I made a video building an epic graveyard for Halloween and then it took me slightly longer to finish. But it's still epic, so let's roll the video. This is a graveyard. A very lousy graveyard. But I wanna build the biggest and scariest graveyard you can imagine, containing one gravestone for all the villagers I recently slaughtered and a bunch for more pillagers, traders, players, hostile mobs and more. There's just one problem. I only have about 40 hours left to do all of this and make this whole video about it until it's midnight on the 31st of October. Step 1. Layout. So I wanna sketch where which part of the giant graveyard will be, including different sections for villagers, hostile mobs and all the other kinds of categories I mentioned. It's just that I might have lost most of the heads from the over a hundred villagers I recently killed. And since I think there's unfortunately just no way to get those back, I'm just gonna go to sleep. Oh wow, a bunch of heads conveniently reappeared without any reason. Luckily I didn't have to mass murder any villagers to get that. But I slept for quite a while because now there's only 25 hours left to build this whole graveyard. So let's get started. To start off let's grab some temporary blocks for outlines. So I'm thinking there'll be four categories. Players, go away slime. This will be from, well, the actual players on the server. Then villagers, which will be by far the biggest category with also wandering traders and pillagers, because they're also kind of villagers. Passive mobs or animals, as I would call them in this case. And then hostile mobs. First important task of the layout, make this area more comfortable to work in. So I light it up. And now that no hostile mobs are spawning in here, I will slime proof it. Now all of this is completely empty and no mobs or slimes will spawn. And if I fly there, I can turn 360 degrees and here is the layout. So about 50% of it is the villagers, then there's the player heads, the animals and the hostile mobs. Sorry, the other way around. These are the hostile mobs and these are the animals. Regardless, every single sand block is gonna be one grave. So let's get some resources to build these graves. Now it's 10 a.m. on the 31st, so there's 14 hours left. And I got all of these resources. As you can see here, it's quite a lot. And I also edited everything you've seen in this video up until now. No, I didn't sleep. Like, I, I literally didn't. Another thing that I did instead of sleeping was expanding the original 64 times 96 big graveyard to a 96 times 160 block graveyard because the original size just couldn't possibly fit the 385 tombstones I needed. They would have had to be so close together that you couldn't walk through there anymore. So now building up the walls around this will take quite a while and a lot of resources. But regardless, since there's only 14 hours left to do everything else, let's start to design a few different kinds of gravestones so that I can then fill all of this up with them. Step 2. Gravestones. This really shouldn't have taken me 45 minutes, but it's 10.47 a.m. now and I made 10 different types of gravestones. Wooden cross, slightly less wooden cross, basic stone, stone cross, pillar, horizontal grave, more horizontal grave, broken up tiny grave, not so broken up tiny grave, and big pillar. And since I've got about 300 graves to build, I'll build about 30 of each of those. And just to make it clear, these are just like the basic blocks, like this just means it's gonna be a full stone block. It's not all gonna be stone brick exclusively, that would be boring. Now I'll build the tombstone behind me 39 times inside the graveyard 
to see how long that will roughly take. Good news and bad news. The good news is this only took about half an hour to do. The bad news is it's still 1.40 pm because I ate and also edited the rest of the video until here. But now I think you're ready for a time lapse of everything. I hope I can get this done in a few hours. Later. Well, that didn't quite show me finishing everything, cause I didn't yet. And it's the 27th of January now, I wanna upload this video in 11 and a half hours, so I'm once again under time pressure. Now, let's make the second time lapse, where I finish the whole graveyard. Finally it's done, a ginormous graveyard. I worked on this for like 9 hours today and it's only 4.40 pm so I got up early for this and I would have given each of these guys names and death days but that's just not enough time anymore. In 140 minutes this video should be uploaded, I don't even have a thumbnail yet and I'm not done editing. But maybe I'll do that in the future. For now let's fly through here one last time with free cam and look at the ginormosity of this thing if that's even a word and with that i hope you enjoyed this video it was entertaining for me to make although slightly stressful and please like and subscribe watch the video to my left and hopefully see you in my next video